Matthew chapter number 15 verses number 12, 13, and 14. Then came his disciples and said unto him, Knowest thou that the Pharisees were offended after they heard the saying? But he answered and said, Every plant which my heavenly Father hath not planted shall be rooted up. Let them alone. They be blind leaders of the blind. And if the blind lead the blind, both shall fall into the ditch. Verse number 12. The disciples were informing Jesus or Yeshua of the obvious. And we know Yeshua or Jesus was totally concerned with the will of the Father. So when he said verse number 10 and verse number 11, he didn't say it as if he were afraid of the Pharisees. What would they think? What would they do? He's telling them that their traditions are wrong. He spoke the word of God without fear and his disciples was like um, master um, they were offended because they knew eventually where this would lead but Yeshua and Jesus just told them every plant that my father has not planted will be rooted up in other words when you pull up a plant by the roots you eliminate all chances of that plant coming back because a lot of times if you leave the root system in some tree and some types of plants it has a chance to come back but when you take and destroy the plant with the complete root system it will have no chance of coming back and that is what he's communicating to his disciples the father is going to root them up anyway we can go back and it's it's in his word we remember the story in chapter number 13 about how the tares would be gathered and burned in fire and then verse number 41 actually goes into that as well in chapter number 13 the son of man shall send forth his angels and they shall gather out of his kingdom all that offend so the word talks about God rooting up or taking up these plants and then it goes on he said let them alone they are blind leaders of the blind and we can see here that was referred to in Matthew 23rd chapter verse number 16 through 24 where he was sternly and sharp, sharply rebuking the Pharisees and the scribes and he said woe unto you you blind guys would say whosoever shall swear by the temple it is nothing and he goes on he rebuked them sharply and let them know that they were blind but he said that they were blind leading the blind so the question is if they were the blind who were the other blind people that were following them anybody that was gullible enough to just follow them the scribes and Pharisees follow their hypocrisy was blind as well the scriptures talks about how he came and showed light in great darkness now after this light has appeared and you still chooses to follow the scribes and Pharisees of that day in their total hypocrisy then you were blind following the blind and you both would fall off into the ditch and perish God in the name of Jesus we bless you and give you glory and honor